Hey, how are you doing? I am Geo. Welcome to the channel and welcome to another music reaction and welcome to another Nightwish reaction. Um, so I put a little poll up on the YouTube page in by overwhelming majority, overwhelming majority was romanticized from back in 2013. Of course I did the reaction, my first experience of Nightwish ever never even heard of them let alone heard them never even heard of them in i heard ghost love score in my fucking god genuinely it's maybe the best thing i've heard in the last couple of years um see in the problem i've got with falling out of is i genuinely don't see how it gets any better i did not see how you can improve that ghost love score was fucking everything i like in music it was hard it was loud, it was big, it was epic, it was cinematic, amazing. And I didn't see, you can maybe get the same, right? You can maybe get as good as, I didn't see how they improve it. Maybe they can't, maybe they can't, maybe I, see, maybe I started at the pinnacle, right? But I'm sure, I'm absolutely sure it'll still, still be amazing. Um, thank you everybody for the comments and the well wishes and the welcomes. I really appreciate it. Um, so without further ado, because you're not here to hear me speak. This is Nightwish Romanticize Live at Wacken By the way, I want to stop it much because like sacrilege. But see for what I've seen on Nightwish, see our drummer. Brilliant, absolutely amazing. See for me the the basis, a good song starts with a good drummer, right? It really does. It can make or break our band or our song. In especially with metal or like anything like that. You know, sometimes you get away with it a lot. You know, like jazz drums, but see, for like that kind of music, you need strong, strong drums, and he's got it. absolutely unreal what I've seen. Just the whole kind of band belt around a oh, fucking beat, and I love it. Um, so that seems a lot more standard metal, right? The vocals are still there, it still sounds good, it's much, seems darker and much more a metal feel, right? But it's what it is. So the beatus singing. He's got a voice there. He's got a voice. He has got a fucking voice there. Wow. Wow.
Wow. Wow. That's perfect. That is fucking perfect. That was that was romanticized in um I've got to say everybody who chose that like good choice, well done, kudos. Um to be absolutely honest with you from the start I thought, oh, this is not as good. Which you know but it it was a slow build, right? And see when you got to the middle to the end of the song, that is Amazing. See the um the bassist voice. Is it bassist? See his voice. Compliment in floors voice. Perfect. It sounds so fucking good. He's got rough, stuff, powerful, powerful voice. She's got just play off each other is absolutely amazing. Like I says, for me, with my background in my personal choice, drums are a massive, massive part of what makes music good, right? And they've got it. That sounds so powerful so tight so i can so um big but accurate at the same time right it doesn't spell too much either right everything's tight but it's huge um the guitarist spot on tell me something though is that guitar short or is the rest of the band just really tall because he seems like he's about four foot tall he seems like tiny and the rest of the band are like huge but yeah that was that was nightwish romanticized Walk in. Where was that in the the, the set list? Because I think um, Ghost Love score was like the thirteenth or fifteen. Where was that? Okay. No, it's, it's not even matter. Sounds amazing. Um, so I've been listening up. I've been looking up some Nightwish stuff. I've been doing my research. I haven't listened to anything because I want to do it here. I don't want to waste the experience. I really don't. So what's next? What's next? What is going to blow me away? Or just different. Differently, right? But thank you everybody for watching and listening and sharing this with me. I appreciate it and I will catch you next time.